Vaheguru Ji Ka Khalsa, Vaheguru Ji Ki Fateh, I am Pushpinder Kaur and today we are going to work in uh, the book um, Punjabi Yes. Punjabi Yes is a, a faster paced course. It covers level one and two in one year, um, basically 24, 25 lessons. And in this you learn all the Pantheokri, you learn all the nine um, vowel symbols and 10 vowel sounds and all the six sound modifiers. So basically after you finish this book and if you worked hard, you are ready to read Punjabi um, and, and understand um, a lot of it, um, vocabulary. There's a lot of vocabulary in as, as well as well. So today we are going to work on lesson number 19, which is the sound modifier to P. As you have learned, congratulations, all the letters and most of them, all of the matras. And now we are on to the sound modifiers. There are total five sound modifiers. There's Adak, Tipi, Bindi, um, chota ha ha, chota ra ra, chota baba. Okay, those are the uh, sounds you already know. Adak you learned uh, very early on because adak you is used in many of the words. Now tipi is used to add uh, nasal sound to the words. For example, if I wrote this, oh my marker is not the best. So if I wrote this, what would you read? What would you say this is? Ab, ab, ab means right now, right? You can say ab. So when I do this, then it becomes amb. Amb is yum, yum, mango, right? So it is added at the top of the line. It is added between two letters. That's, and it looks like a crescent moon. It looks like this. Okay. Okay. Well, let me see. Let me move the paper down a little. There. Okay. So this is what it looks like. Right. Now, um, there are exceptions. The, that it cannot be used with the sum of the matras. It's very picky, it's used with only a few matras. So we can use tippy in um, mukta words. We can use tippy um, with the sahari words, mint. We can use tippy with onkar words, like um, sun. Sun. Sun means numb, right? We can use with the Lankar words. We can say moon. 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 Okay? Or we can use with um, menu. We can say also menu. Man. Nu. Okay? With the Lankar words. And you also can use it with, yeah, four. Mukta, Sihari, uh, Ankar, and the Lankar words. You cannot use it with any other matra. Okay, with them we will use um, Bindi. So here are some words. This is India, and we want to make it India. What do we do? You write um, here. Can you see it? Yeah. So you wrote idia and you add India. Okay. You will add a um, tippy at the top. Pid. How do you make it pinned? Go ahead and write pinned here. Sig. Sing. Pun Punjab and Punjab. Okay. So um, that's how you're going to write in the, in the tippy in the middle. Now, here are some um, examples. There's two choices for you. Pick the correct word. Hare, Angur, Khatte, Han, Satrangi, Ping, which Satrang, Hunde, Han, Bohot, Sikh, Punjab, De, Pinda, which Rende, Han. You have to circle the correct word. Simple, Da Matlab, Sada, Hai. Sing da matlab janwaran de sirwale sing horn hai 
ਪੰਜਾਬ ਦੇ ਅੰਬ ਬਹੁਤ ਸਵਾਦ ਹੁੰਦੇ ਹਨ ਓਕੇ ਸੋ ਯੂ ਵਿਲ ਫਾਈਂਡ ਦਾ ਕਰੈਕਟਲੀ ਸਪੈਲਡ ਵਰਡਸ ਇਨ ਥੀਸ ਐਂਡ ਸਰਕਲ देम ਨਾਉ ਦਾ ਨੈਕਸਟ ਇਜ਼ ਐਨ ਐਗਜ਼ਾਮਪਲ ਥੈਟ ਯੂ ਹੈਵ ਬੀਨ ਡੂਇੰਗ ਆਈ ਥਿੰਕ ਸੈਵਰਲ ਟਾਈਮਸ देयर ਇਜ਼ ਫਿਊ ਵਰਡਸ ਐਂਡ ਯੂ ਵਿਲ ਲਰਨ ਹਾਊ ਟੂ ਸਪੈਲ देम ਕਰੈਕਟਲੀ ਨਾਉ ਲੈਟਸ ਰੀਡ ਦਾ ਵਰਡਸ ਟੁਗੇਦਰ ਐਂਡ ਆਈ ਵਿਲ ਆਲਸੋ ਟੈਲ ਯੂ ਦਾ ਮੀਨਿੰਗਸ ਆਫ ਸਮ ਆਫ ਦਾ ਵਰਡਸ ਥੈਟ ਯੂ ਮੇ ਔਰ ਮੇ ਨਾਟ ਨੋ ਪਿੰਡ ਇਜ਼ ਅ ਵਿਲੇਜ ਨਾਟ ਅ ਬਿਗ ਸਿਟੀ ਅ ਸਮਾਲ ਵਿਲੇਜ ਪਿੰਡਾ ਪਿੰਡਾ ਇਜ਼ ਯਰ ਬਾਡੀ ਤਨ ਓਕੇ ਪਿੰਜਰ ਪਿੰਜਰ ਇਜ਼ ਯਰ ਸਕੈਲਟਨ ਪਿੰਗਲਾ pingla is a is a is a person who is um not able to walk limp person uh punjab is our state punjaban is a woman uh who is from punjab punjabi uh can mean many things punjabi is a language punjabi is also a person <clears throat> punjabio when we call somebody hey punjabio aa jao punjabi sikhiye ਪੰਜਾਬ ਦੇ ਪੰਜਾਬੀਓ ਆਓ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਸਿੱਖੀਏ ਪੰਗਤ ਪੰਗਤ ਇਜ਼ ਅ ਲਾਈਨ ਵੀ ਯੂਜੂਅਲੀ ਸਿਟ ਇਨ ਪੰਗਤ ਐਂਡ ਵੀ ਈਟ ਲੰਗਰ ਸੰਗਤ ਸੰਗਤ ਇਜ਼ ਦ ਕੰਗਰੀਗੇਸ਼ਨ ਵੈਨ ਵੀ ਸਿਟ ਇਨ ਗੁਰਦੁਆਰਾ ਵੀ ਆਰ ਸੰਗਤ ਸਤਰੰਗੀ ਮੀਨਸ ਸੈਵਨ ਕਲਰਸ ਸਤਰੰਗਾ ਵਾਲੀ ਆਫ ਥੈਟਸ ਪੋਸੈਸਿਵ ਐਂਡ ਸਿੰਗੋ ਲਾਈਕ ਸਿੰਗੋ ਆਓ ਵਸਾਖੀ ਮਨਾਈਏ ਯਸਟਰਡੇ ਵੀ ਹੈਡ ਵਸਾਖੀ ਰਾਈਟ ਸੋ ਥੀਸ ਆਰ ਸਮ ਆਫ ਦ ਵਰਡਸ that you um will uh, you know what they mean and you know now how to spell them and this is what you're going to do for your homework and uh, this is an example of pyramid spelling and i will write one for you so that you will um be able to do this on your own let me move this paper a little bit to the side so let's take the word punjabi right so i draw a pyramid punjabio so the word is punjabi o oh, i took the longest word so i will start with p then i will say p nj punj pan ja oops pan ja b pan ja b o so ignore this line in there okay so what does pyramid spelling do to you it teaches you how to spell the the letters the words better okay <clears throat> this is one of the strategies it takes you some time to think about every letter every sound and then you learn how to spell them so that is our lesson for today so hopefully you will not make any mistake um you can do a test later on to see how well you have learned these words and next time um we will learn the bindi lesson just like tippy we have bindi you can also teach it to yourself and but if you want to wait then we will work on it um in a few days okay thank you so much for working hard with me and i will see you next time thank you bye ji khalsa bye ji ki fate